Welcome to an example in which we'll use two color counters to explain why subtracting a negative is equivalent to adding a positive. So for review, we use a yellow counter for a positive one and a red counter for a negative one. And notice how one yellow and one red counter would be equal to zero. We'll consider the problem three minus negative four. We want to begin by modeling positive three. To do this, we would use three yellow counters. So here's positive three. And then we have minus negative four, which means you want to remove or take away four red counters. But notice how we don't have four red counters to remove or take away, which means we'll have to introduce zeros. Notice how if we introduce four yellow counters and four red counters, the result is zero. So we still have positive three here. But when positive three is modeled in this way, notice how because we have minus negative four, we can now remove or take away these four red counters. So we're going to remove or take away these four red counters. And notice how once we do this, we're left with seven yellow counters, which equals positive seven, which means three minus negative four equals positive seven. So using the colored counters, we've shown that three minus negative four is equivalent to three plus four, which equals seven. Removing four red counters is equivalent to adding four yellow counters, which means subtracting a negative is equivalent to adding a positive. I hope you found this helpful.